Welcome to a sold-out Hard Schlock Stadium, home of the Diami Kraken. You know they're named after a monster sea creature, so the fans are called Finns. That's because they're trying to keep the team afloat, Grim. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers. The Cardinal Sins go up against the Diami Kraken. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. See that move, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see that because I'm too fast. <laughs> it's time to tune in, turn on, and drop what you're doing because NFL Game Day is on the air. Hi, everyone. Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. So what's the game plan for the home team today, Bricks? Uh, I think they got to keep it simple. A little cough syrup, maybe smoke a little untidy pod pregame so they can keep their heads in the game. I mean, literally. You don't want to get decapitated on the opening kickoff. I say go after the refs early and often. No mercy. Hot two. Hot three. Mama, he just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Hot Sorry, two. partner. Hot. Hey. Just keep pounding the ball right up the gut, and you'll tire these guys out. First down. And it's first and ten. Hot one. Hot two. Hot because whatever they juice that player with to make him run that fast can't be legal. Second down in a very lot. One, hot two, hot, hot. Drills one in for the first down. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 Oh, big catch. Big run. Big touchdown. Yeah, big deal. This the meat for break. Grab the ball and fall down. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. Straight through the uprights. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. First and ten. And he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get something going here. And it's first and ten. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. Second and three. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. Seriously, man, you think you go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? You get my grill, I'll ruin your world. Ruin it.
Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> Goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. And he gets three yards on that run. Second down and seven. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. The quarterback has had enough and calls a murder ball dirty trick to lay waste to the defense. Running like a moose right now. And he finds open space, is running toward the end zone. Turn on your jets, you son of a bitch. He's at the 10. And he held on to that one for a first down. Hmm, I don't remember that being an officially sanctioned MFL rule. Second down and more. And the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. Second down in a mile. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot three. And the passing game picking up some steam, a gain of seven there. Third down, and the QB is saying his hot, prayers. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. And that's an incomplete pass. Looks like the defense got away with that one there. I didn't want to grab the receiver like that. He could get hurt. Well, they couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a nice catch, and he turns on the afterburner. That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. And it's first and ten. Hit, and the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutant me. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. warming up <laughs> there's no reason to go for it here but they do anyway Blast just cleared the field for the receiver. Wow, and that was well played. The defense anticipated a pass and put an end to the offense's drive. Not tonight, fellas. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot three. Oh, he almost broke that one wide open. Hey, speaking of breaking one wide open, who's sitting on the oil rig about to blow? Hey, smells like an oven big porn at John in here. We're a freaking fracking accident waiting to happen. Don't nobody light a match. 
And that's a run for no gain. Then it's not really a run, is it? Third and two. I thought the only tie we'd see would be a noose. Instead, they're in a dead heat. Tie game at the end of one. Third and two. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made into dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. They need to make him a target more often. Well, I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about? And it's first and ten. And that's a run for no gain. Second down and ten. Talking about Butterfingers, he should have had that one. Third down and ten. for the kick. This isn't a gimme. He's got the distance, and the kick is good! The teams are lined up for the kickoff. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can return it for... You know what? Never mind. Oh, with a brutal hit! And it's first and ten. Oh, no, it's a sticky ball, dirty trick. The defense pretty much turned the ball into a yo-yo of doom. Did you ever think you'd say that, Grim? A yo-yo of doom? No, my friend, I didn't. I love this job. What did this about Second down and a lot. Boom! Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> And it's first and ten. One time, when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. Oh, and that one's gonna hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. And it's first and ten. And the crowd goes wild! Touchdown! Touchdown! Say what? Come on, man, you can't hang with me. You get my grill, I'm gonna ruin your world. You understand me?
Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. And it's first and ten. And with a burst of speed, he finds an opening and the first down. And it's first and ten. Falls to the ground. That's incomplete. He needs to throw it when a receiver can catch it. What's he doing? And uh, groundbreaking analysis as always there, Bricks. Oh, thank you. I do my part. How do you like your defensive cook? The ball carrier saying, well done. Bang, baby, bang. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim. But my watch is a bit slow. Picks up two yards on the pass. Then this guy's six feet tall. He could just have fallen over and gotten two yards. And that'll be second and eight to go. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. And they take their first time out. Uh, how predictable. Surprise us next time. Call the time out there in half. And it's first and ten. <laughs> well, that's two timeouts burned. And you have to wonder, Bricks, are they desperate or are they in control? Yeah, I'm speaking from experience, Grim, but it really is hard to do both at the same time. And I have mastered it. And he catches it for six yards. Good mitts on that play, Bricks. His fingers are like a bunch of sausages. The quarterback just used his final timeout. Let's see what they come up with on the next play. Third down and long. A nice chunk of yards on that pass play. The defense calls a timeout to stop the clock. They have two left. It's not short, but this one shouldn't give the kicker any trouble. Unless he collapses under pressure and never makes another kick again. Hmm. That's bleak, Bricks. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. And it's first and ten. When the defense calls Thunderclap, the offense is toast. Oh, did he ever get zapped? Reminds me, you ever hear that Zappa song, Watch Out Where the Huskies Go? Don't you eat that yellow snow? When I was a kid, I always ate the yellow snow. They were like lemon snow cones. But them fudge ice cream sandwiches, eh, they didn't taste so good. Second down and six. And that's how you run the football. First down. 
That's it. That's their last time out. It's them against the other team and the clock. Ah, that doesn't seem fair. I'm going to throw a hammer on the field and even the odds. And then a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. Thank God he's still got his leg. He's going to need all of it for this kick. Hey, a sawbuck says he misses. The kick is good. Uh, as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. I still want to sell him. I am on hell and I'll sell him. They need a good return here to set up the offense. They're going to be able to return this one. The second quarter comes to a close as the teams head for the locker room, and we take you to halftime. Brought to you by Monsatan Industries. We make genetically engineered food that is to die for. It's the start of the third quarter, and we are set to go, Bricks. Oh, boy! Where are we going, Grim? A carnival? Huh? Uh, they're going to go to a strip tease show. Where are we going? Hey, why don't you sell down? Just pet your rabbit, Lenny. Just pet your rabbit. Yo, man, nobody can touch me when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Seven yards on that play. Second and three. And that's a nice run for a first down. First and ten. Point, actually. 
That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all. It appears that the ref just received a pair of very expensive alligator skin shoes. They need to put some cement shoes on before this game slips away. I almost wanted a pair of alligator skin shoes, Grim. I heard though when you put them on, they feel just like chicken skin shoes. First down and long. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. First down and forever. Man, this guy just exploded into flames. Now the defense has to try to tackle the running. One potato, two potato, three potato, four. The defense just blew up a player who thought he was going to score. <laughs> oh, that hot potato dirty trick gets him every time. Second down and long. And the runner is going crazy fast. Look at the path he's taking. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> I don't know if he even had a target on that throw. And out comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. And he snags the punt and looks for open field. I had a dog named Snag. Oh, with a punishing hit. And it's first and ten. going to shave a few days off his life. And it's first and ten. He broke free and has open field in front of him. Man, are these guys greedy or desperate? Either way, they're going for two. Bam! Gutsy run for the conversion! When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. <laughs> and it's first and ten. ran into the line at the DMV. And guess what, Grim? That line ain't moving. Yeah, that was kind of my point, Bricks. Second down and ten. And he pounds the ball into the defense, picking up seven. Third and two. He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. Yeah. 
Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a return. The return man catches the ball, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, sounds like my offseason. And it's first and ten. We know this quarterback likes to play with soft balls, but the defense, they're playing with big balls and just crushed his balls. That's a lot of balls, Ben. <laughs> Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. That pass play nets them seven yards. Oh, no. I got the hiccups again. What are you supposed to do to get rid of them again? You stick it in a plastic bag, say the alphabet backwards while you set yourself on fire and jump out the window. It ought to stop them. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. And that brings us to the end of the third quarter. They'll need to fire on all cylinders to make a comeback in the final quarter. And it's first and ten. Taking what the defense has given them. That's a four yard gain on the reception. Hey, less than a wipe for the headache. Second down and six. This guy's going to get mugged in the locker room by his team after the game. Third down and six. Running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe two. Uh, we always ran with a load in our pants, Grim. It's a pretty good defensive tool. Yeah, except the zombies. They are freaks. A fake punt. If you can't trust a punter, who can you trust? And they get stumped cold. Hey, Grim. Remember what I said when Bricks wanted to bring in a fish buffet in our tiny air sealed broadcast booth? I believe that was. Who could have thought that was a good idea? Yeah, just checking. I'm thinking that again. Shoveled his feet so well on that play. He should go to lost wages and deal cards. First down. And it's first and ten. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. Second down and nine. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. A pickup of about three on that play. And that'll bring up second and one. Whoa. And the defense puts one over on the quarterback with a sticky ball dirty trick. The only thing the QB can do now is... Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! And here comes the extra point attempt. It's good. They need a good return here to set up the offense. 
Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. And it's first and ten. Catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. And it's first and ten. And he runs it for four yards. Second down and six. Catches it for a touchdown! What a beautiful play! Yeah, it's almost power this win! What a high cool! Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Straight through the uprights. The onside kick is a desperation play, but it's their only chance at this point to steal a possession. Stealing ain't right, Grim. It just ain't right. And it's first and ten. Killer, it was right there, and then he dropped it. Ah, oh, scumbag is killing me in the fantasy league. Second down and ten. Murphy Brown! What? I mean, first down! What the hell was that? I, uh, I honestly don't know, Grim. And this is a first and long. And they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. First down in a mile. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. Second down and more than the QB would like. Well, it looks like he wanted to run before he caught it. You gotta keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You gotta make that catch. Third down and, well, good luck. And the ball hits the field incomplete. He threw it when no one could catch it. Some things like that in the quarterback. Not many kickers can kick it over 50 yards in these brutal conditions. Let's see if he can do what few others can. That was like a movie trailer, Grant. Straight through the uprights. Yeah, man, he was on the now. You know, man. <laughs> They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. Yeah. 
two minutes remaining in the game. We'll be right back, folks. Jeez, can this game take any longer? I got a date with Hot Wanda after this. Junior, I told you that girl's nothing but trouble. And I don't think that's a mole on her lip either. Catch the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. <laughs> And he takes a timeout here. They have two left. I wonder if he has a plan. Well, maybe he's just going to take the teeth out of the back of his neck that have been stuck there since the opening play. Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be. They used their second timeout, but they are running out of time. A bit pessimistic, don't you think so, Grim? It's more about building tension, Bricks. That's all we do at this point. And drink this bourbon. Come on, give me that. <laughs> and that'll bring up the quarterback just used his final timeout. Let's see what they come up with on the next play. And the quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. He scores! He earned those points on the heels of an epic run. Nah, don't call things epic, Grim. Kids are going to think you're cool no matter what you do. Junior, I don't want kids to think I'm cool. I like this, they're going for two. And they run it in for two points. Looks like they're lined up for an onside kick. Uh, I thought they were going to do some sort of chorus line. They usually only talk about kickers when they win or lose games. Well, this guy just earned his paycheck. Which is typically the amount the quarterback tips on dinner. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. And nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self-doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. Yeah, you think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? You mistaken, man. You get up my grill, I'm going to ruin your world. I'm going to wreck it. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? Goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. He'll be going on site here, and the return team is ready for it. No surprises here. That's a bad kick, and it's going to cost them some yards. The kicker's going to have to kick the ball just right so his team can recover it. And it's first and ten. Oh, nice hit! First and ten. And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass, he was on to the races. Now, 
some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sick. It's good. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. Oh, with the brain scrambler. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. Disappointing to a Diami fan? I don't know. Ever get a soggy hot dog bun with your hot dog? Soggy bun? That makes me sad. And let's go down to the field and hear the MVP. He's a real role model for the kids, Bricks. That is, if you want your kids to be a roid raging narcissist with uncontrollable verbal diarrhea. Oh, that personality disorder has a name. It's called autotropism. Hey, okay, now back you. Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microheart Corporation. They get it right every up.